I've certainly had my fair share of failure. I think probably the most impactful one in my career has been the supplement business. It's now a multi-million dollar business. I started with my sister in 2013. We were working in the health space and with another company that we actually tried to purchase, which also fell through. So that technically kind of could have been a failure too. And out of that came the opportunity to say, hey, let's go start our own supplement company. And we had the idea, this was back in 2012, 13, before the whole nootropic and brain health science field exploded of coming up with a, like a high performance supplement for brain health because no one at the time was doing it. And so we started this business. At one point we were juggling 22 credit cards. We had a second mortgage on the house, all self-funded. We were trying to make the business successful. We had this original vision of starting this high performance entrepreneur athlete type company. And I woke up one day and I realized our customers were baby boomers who were afraid of dementia. <laughs> and, and that's about 180 degrees away from the original vision. And while the business was successful at that point, I realized it wasn't the business I had dreamed of. And it wasn't the business I even wanted to be in. I actually ended up leaving that business. And so not only did I have four years of my life invested into this company, I now had to walk away start over that entire investment was gone and now in hindsight the opportunity cost my sister continues to run that business it's now a multi-million dollar business so that's a hard lesson and that always goes to being really clear with your vision